I think that the term deep research won't even exist in a couple of years time. Uh, because, you know, it's a it's a new concept for us right now. And so everyone is hopping on this research train because research is one of the biggest use cases for applied AI right now. Um, and we're kind of seeing that shine through in lots of different use cases from due diligence to, you know, sales or company due diligence or um, grant writing. Like these are lots of the things that we're, companies are using deep research for. But I think we're starting to see an emergence on the product side, uh, which we already see if you go onto GPT right now or, or ChatGPT right now. Deep research is being kind of hidden behind the scenes. You're using it, but you don't know you're using it because to the user, it's not necessarily obvious. But GPT-5 has deep research built in, which means that it's calling dis different systems for different types of tasks. So it will become almost easier for the end user to use a deep research system because they won't even know they're using it. The system will just decide, hey, this is a complicated question that we need to use this type of system for. So I'm gonna navigate you to a deep research system.